Hey, welcome to Give Me Apps, you're at Mall, the number one independent app store. Today we're checking out cheap hotels and flight booking deals by Phil Apps. This is for Android. If you're looking for any hotel, any flight, in about any city, this app will help you do that easily. Guys, we're talking about choices between 8 million hotels listed for booking. You also have about 700 plus airlines for booking worldwide. And of course, as I did mention earlier, you can do this in just about any city for any trip reason, for any tour. That's what it says on the app listing. I cannot express how easy this is. Here's the main menu. Take a look. You have the choice between search hotels, you have flights, you have your travel guide, and more. The app works very quickly. It's smooth, nice interface, and will do exactly what it says. We're going to show you how to make this happen right now. Take a look at search hotels. Once you tap on that, it takes you to the hotel area. As you can see, you have your search hotels. You can choose a city. As you can see that we already put in New York City. Um, that's where we are. And it makes a great test because there are many, many hotels here. You can choose the check-in date, the check-out date, and how many guests you're going to have in the room. So we're going to go back in and uh, we'll choose New York City again just because you have many choices here. You can set the check-in date. It is Valentine's Day as we speak. We're going to choose the um, 15th just because and for our checkout date we'll choose the the 18th there we go that's going to be Thursday to Sunday and we can set uh, the number of guests here it says uh, two adults and one room you have different choices you have three adults in one room four and two adults in two rooms we'll stick with two adults in one room because that's the most common and once you're ready you can go if you look at the screen here, it says Expedia, Hotels.com, you have many different choices, and that is what it pulls from for this database. And you also have your trending hotels right now, and it goes on and on. We're going to tap on search, and we'll show you what comes up. And here we go. Take a look here. New York City is very popular on your selected dates. 60% uh, reserves. That's very nice. It shows you the amount of hotels that have been reserved. And as you can imagine, around this time, hotels are pretty much booked. It is Valentine's Day weekend, so keep that in mind. Now, once you have that, you can look between recommended. You can also filter by stars. You also have distance from. That'll show you um, how far you are from the distance center. And of course, we are in New York City. You have many different choices. Now, take a look at those prices. $246, $414, and it goes up. $843. Now, mind you, the uh, filter is not set by price. So you're getting a hodgepodge of different prices, but you can set the filter um, from price. We're not going to do that because uh, we will assume that you know how to do that. Uh, but once again, you do have the um, ability to filter by the number of stars. Of course, that'll be one to five stars. Distance from, you have your price, you have your um, guest rating, and you also have uh, excluding taxes. So that's a very nice way to go. You can see your star listing here on the side. Now, if you want to check out any other section of the app, all you need to do is tap on the uh, back here over here and it will take you to the uh, main menu. There you are. As you can see there, we're back to the search hotels page. Of course, you can refresh by tapping on that icon right there. So we are going to go back to the main screen. We have our flights area. Let's check that out. Now, take a look here. Easy travel, cheap flights, and hotel search. Uh, of course, you can um, choose your destination and, of course, your origin. And as you can see, it says New York, United States uh, for our destination. We'll just type in Chicago. Now, Notice how everything is indexed, which makes your uh, usage of this app a lot easier. We're going to tap on Chicago, Illinois. But as you can see, we did type in CH, and you get Ho Chi Minh City over there in Vietnam. Um, Chania in Greece, Charleston, South Carolina. We'll go with Chicago just because. You have your depart date, and you have your return date. It says there February 21st. For our return date, we'll choose the 24th. Let's go for the whole week, or just about. That's Wednesday to Saturday, so half the week. And of course, you can choose the number of passengers. It says one passenger there. You can bring that up to as many as you want. You have children under 12 years. You also have infants under two years. And of course, you have business class. You can choose that if you want to do that. We'll stick with one passenger just because it's easy. And uh, take a look here. You can choose the language as well. You see there it says English, the uh, British flag, the flag of the UK. We're going to tap on search. Now, this is going to be a little more finicky just because... Uh, of course, it is going to be date sensitive, as the hotel booking would be. And take a look here. Uh, we have Spirit Airlines starting at 135. We have, again, Spirit Airlines at 135, 143. 
These are great prices. Now, mind you, the drive from New York City to Chicago would be about 12 to 15 hours. And uh, 143 ain't bad. You have your United Airlines, and it goes down from there. Look at those depart times, 7 o'clock in the morning, 8.40 in the morning, uh, 21.59. If I'm not mistaken, that would be uh, 9.59 at night um, to 8.40. Uh, mind you, we are talking uh, Central and Mountain time there, I believe, so that's why you have that, um, that discrepancy. So you have 8.35 to 8.40, and it goes on down. Uh, as you can see, you have mostly uh, Spirit Airlines and United here. Those would be some of the cheapest um, carriers. Uh, you'd be able to uh, work with. All right, so this is straightforward, guys. You choose your origin area, your area of origin, you choose your destination, and you go, you're off, and you have many different choices you can choose from. This could not be easier. And from there, you would book everything. You have your filter area, take a look at that. Uh, you have your number of stops, you have your duration of stops, your layovers, you have your airfares. And you can use these filters to um, get exactly what it is that you're looking for. So this could not be any easier. And the process is very straightforward. Tap on book and you are ready to go. All right. Do download the app to see the entire process, but it could not be any easier. Similarly, you can get back by tapping on the back key. That brings us to our, um, our first uh, page. And that brings us back to the original page. As you can see here, we have our travel guide. We can tap on that icon and take a look here. You have your go trip. It is taking a little while to load up. Just give it a moment. And here we are. You can search. You have your nearest location. You can work with that. And just because, uh, we'll do that. Now take a look here. You have Las Vegas, New York City, San Francisco, London, Los Angeles, Paris, Rome, Bar Barcelona, Tokyo, Sydney. You have your view all destinations. We'll stick with New York City just because that is that seems to be the theme of this video. And take a look here. You have all of these different tours. This is a very nice touch to the app. Uh, we have reviewed a few hotel booking apps before and we have not seen this facility added. And you have your choice of different tours. Take a look at that. Big Apple helicopter tour of New York. I've lived in New York City all of my life and I have not checked that out. You have um, New York Manhattan scenic helicopter tour. You have your freestyle pass. You have your um, New York dinner cruise, you have your New York City pass, shared round trip transfer to New York airports and Manhattan hotels. And look at those prices. Uh, we have the helicopter tour starting at $199. That's not bad at all. And we can go down. Now you have your small group tour of catacombs by candlelight in New York starting at $35. And take a look at that. You have 93 pages of different tours. So, guys. This is a great app if you're trying to get around and you are looking for cheap hotels, if you are looking for a good priced flight, a cheaply priced flight um, with quality service, we'll say that because United is not bad, or if you're looking for a tour guide, travel guide, this app has it all and it's very easy to get around as you have seen in this video. So please do check it out. Guys, this is Cheap Hotels and Flight Booking Deals by Phil Apps. We highly recommend you do check this out. It's very easy to use, very easy to get around. It is pertinent, filled to the brim with pertinent information for um, those three categories. So do check it out. Guys, you are checking our YouTube channel. This is youtube.com slash give me apps. Give me apps is the world's number one independent app store. You can literally find apps for just about any platform. And if you're a developer, it's the only site, the only store where you can keep the full 100% of your download sales. Guys, thanks for checking out this video. Do comment below. Let us know what you think. Have you used this app? Use this app. If you have not, please do download it. Compare it to other apps and let us know your thoughts. Uh, the people who create these apps, these wonderful developers, do check out these videos and can use that information to improve their offering. Guys, we hope you enjoyed this as much as we did. Till next time.